In this video, we will understand the interfacing of LDR with STM32F4 series microcontroller. Here, discovery board is used, and on that board, there are four LEDs connected to port D, pin number 12, 13, 14, 15. So, let's start with the. I am using the kill software to understand the mechanism. Working is uh, simple. The way we have used it for push button, same way the code is written. And digital input will be read from the LDR. And if the input is sensed, we'll turn on the LEDs. And if not, turn off the LEDs. Okay. Now, uh, first we need to enable the peripheral clock for port D. Enable the peripheral clock for A. Then set the direction of A as the digital input. Set direction of port D pin 12, 13, 14, 15 as a digital output. In Y1, we are reading the con condition of the digital input which is coming from an LDR. Okay. If input is read as a high using the input data register IDR, then we need to turn on the LEDs connected to 12, 13, 15 using the register with bit reset DSSR. So, this is the way how we can write the logic and if not, then turn off the LED. Okay. So, just compile the code. Download it into the hardware and now see the if you look on the hardware this is the discovery board this is the LDR and signal conditioning circuit for the LDR this is his ground coming from the LDR system and it you know which is considered as a digital input Yes, okay. Now, under the current condition, the light is present in my room, hence the LEDs are turned off. Now, if I cover the LDR, means if we make a dark behind that, the resistors will change of the LDR and will turn on the LEDs. Let's see. Yes. Now, I have covered the LDR. You can see the LED, LEDs are turned on. If I uncover the LED, Again, LEDs are turned on. Cover it, will turn on. This is working of LDR. Very simple. Instead of uh, LEDs, you may use the relay, interfacing of relay, to turn on and turn off the LEDs, uh, light or tube light, based on the light conditioning. Okay. Thank you so much.